I'm going to show you some examples of what uh, I, my ex-wife has thought these men that she obviously smoked the marijuana, okay? If my wife's going to leave me, she's obviously going to... She, she, uh, gonna be smoking the marijuanas if my wife left me. Judy, love me. It's time for the Stephen Internet Show. It's time to have a really good time. It's time for the Stephen Internet Show. Can you be my friend? Won't you be my friend? Hi, welcome to the Stephen Internet Show. I hope you will enjoy it. We can be best friends. Hello and good evening, everyone. It is I, Dr. Daniel Slinger, and it is Fathers Against Radical Transformation with your host, Dr. Daniel Slinger here. And the only reason I am giving any kudos and I am playing the opening of, of a terrible show that used to preach the, 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 the kindness and the ways of the, the plant of cannabis, Th- that man is gone, okay? Steve, Stephen George Elgin, Stephen George Michael Elgin, he's a disciple of mine now. I have him in my grips. I don't want to tell you how I had to do it to him, but I had to do it to him, and I had to do it to him hard and right the American way. Remember, this is Fathers Against Radical Transformation. Let's go ahead and get this. Let's go ahead and get this show started. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It is I. It is I, Dr. Daniel Slinger, live here from the war room. And I am having a great time this evening. And I will be telling you about the dangers of cannabis the dangers of marijuanas, the danger of weeds and sticky sticks and icky flicks and dickity dicks because that's what the kids are calling weed these days. And it's getting to the kids. I have I have so many things to show you that it is it will be bewildering. I have things to show you about your children, about two little good kids who went on the way of marijuanas. And now you should see them. With your own eyes, if you wait, you'll be able to see them with clear eyes. These aren't the eyes of a drug user. These are the clear eyes of a clear mind, heart, and soul of an American. All right, everybody. I will be reading uh, your comments and content on here. And hello, welcome, Nate Nate Davidson, Duke Matlock, Michael Brooker, Rob Glow, Hank the Tank, Jenny George Judge, Tiffany George, Tiffany Jones, Dave Driscoll, drug addict, 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 drug addict. That's what's wrong with these people. We got too many gosh darn drug addicts. All right, I'm gonna first. I'm gonna tell you. And let's see if I have it on the right slide. I don't think I do. I'm going to go back a few slides here. Let me go back. Let me ruin my whole bit here. Let me just do that. Here we go with marijuana. Here we go with marijuana. You can read the sign right here. Let me figure out which god darn way to go here. Marijuana's weeds with roots in hell. And hell's bad. I know most of you forgot. I know most of you forgot. Oh, it looks like we may have lost the feed. It looks like we may have lost the feed. I don't know what happened. (laughs) I'm having a laugh right now because guess what? They tried to keep me down and they'll never keep me down. The truth shall prevail because marijuana's. Where was I picking up with this? See, they're trying to not let you guys get the truth. And I am the only one, not your mama, not your papa, not your ma- grandmama, not your granddaddy, not the, the, the constructs of a normal American family. They're not the ones helping you. Okay, I am. I'm your daddy now, okay? W- look at this. Weird orgies. Who wants to have weird orgy, strange sex with bodies writhing around on each other? 
slick, sweaty. It's a little warm in there. The satin sheets are kind of like, ooh, just feel good again. Who wants that? No one wants that. Thank you very much. America, America doesn't want that. What happens at marijuana parties? Oh, I don't know. Hate, tramp, despair, sorrow, just crime, misery. Is that a message to you, Missouri? Because I'm talking to Missouri, but I'm talking to the whole damn world right now. Who we got on here? We got Michael Brooker, Matthew Wittes, Jenny George Elgin, Hank the Tank, Duke Matlock, Stephanie Tuss, Rob Glow, drug addict, drug addict, drug addict, drug addict. And see, when you're having these orgies, this is what you got to make sure. You got to make sure of one thing. Y'all behaving in here? Y'all behaving in here? So when you got these... <clears throat> now let's... A personal... One of my personal heroes is Henry Anslinger. Um, he is one who... A strong, a strong man. Who look kind of like Humpty Dumpty, but a strong Humpty Dumpty with a real savage nature about him. Just a beast who couldn't be unleashed fast enough upon people who could not defend themselves. It was beautiful. But read this quote with me right here. There are 100,000 total marijuana smokers in the U.S. and most are Negroes, Hispanics, Filipinos, and entertainers. Their satanic music, jazz, and swing result from marijuana's use. Marijuana causes white women to seek sexual relations with Negroes, entertainers, and any others. Reefer makes darkies think they're as good as white men. Henry and Slinger. Okay, now I know what you're thinking. This has been, this was taken, this was ripped from the headlines. He's, he's probably a good politician from somewhere in the South. Okay, but he's not. All right, you know what he is? This is from the 1920s. It's like our forefathers told us, okay? This is what the forefathers were talking about right here. This, this is what the forefathers were talking about, okay? Because I'm going to show you some examples of what uh, I, my ex-wife has thought these men, that she obviously smoked the marijuanas, okay? If my wife's going to leave me, she's obviously going to She's, she's gonna be smoking the marijuanas if my wife left me. Judy! Fucking Judy! Alright, pull it together, goddammit, because I'm gonna show you some examples of some real swine here. Oh, who's that? No, I'm gonna leave it to him last. Let me ruin everything I've ever done in my life. Oh, look at this feller. This is a criminal. Can you believe that? And the women folk go crazy for him. Tattoos on his neck? How are you going to get a job if you had tattoos on your neck and face region? One of these? You little crybaby? Oh, I didn't get a job. No one gave me everything I wanted in life, so I had to steal good people's stuff. I had to steal, I had to steal good, hard-working American taxpayers' stuff. I pay my taxes. I don't like having stuff stolen from me. Okay? Let's go on to the next one. This has got me fired up. Oh, and this Jezebel. My wife said this was her get out of jail free. My ex-wife said this man is her get out. Does that make me look any better? If I tuck my head in here and I put my head up here and this is me. Does that make me look any better? I don't think so. Piercing blue eyes. Get out of here facial hair that grows in real this is facial hair this is facial hair that's what a man's facial hair looks like do you know do you see do you see they taught him a man get out of here uh, oh and this guy they got him to play sheer Khan they got him to play sheer Khan Disney got him the sexiest man, an earring. Oh, hey, little girl of mine. Hey, you want to go and French braid each other's hair? Let's go French braid each other's hair, and then we will join a communist community. Let's French braid and communism. It'll be a really good time with my friend Idris, not American. 
Thank you. Disgusting. No woman, no woman in her right mind without marijuanas is going to be with this. No woman in her right mind is going to want to it's going to want to stroke this beer. It's going to it's going to want to no woman's going to want to brush up against these lips. No woman, no woman's gonna, no woman's ever gonna want to do that without marijuanas. And that's how it happens. That's how it happens to our women. And I'm tired of it. Oh, and Enrique Iglesias got the white woman of all white women, Ana Cana Corva Corva. Ana Corna Cop. You know what I'm talking about. She's Russian, but she's pure. You guys can tell. Look at her. And this little sleazy bastard. If he shows up with your daughter and he's got this dang hat on that and this smile and this and this and he's got all he's just got all this and he sings he's got bend your hat right. That ain't, that ain't how you do it in America, okay? He's a Latino freak. Oh, and look at this guy. If he isn't just the Pied Piper of Poontang, Mr. A.C. I don't think so, okay? Now, come on, now. Let me get real about this. This feller, women are going to want to touch these dimples. Women, if I wanted dimples, I would buy a little cabbage patch now. I'd wait in line, and I'd buy a cabbage patch now with dimples, and then I'd rock that to sleep. I wouldn't be hanging out with AC Slater. Forgive me. Y'all behaving in here. Y'all behaving in here. Y'all behaving in here. Hmm? All right. Now, what I'm going to show you next is going to be probably some of the most disturbing things you've ever seen in your life. Now, I want to—I know most of your kids are homeschooled because if you're like me, you're going to homeschool your kids because you can't trust them with other children. You can't trust them with teachers, neighbors, other children, friends, family, other kids. Okay, that's the deal with raising children now. Okay, but I'm going to show you some very disturbing and very shocking things that I'm not even sure they're going to allow on Facebook. But I hope that they do. Because I hope you, I've already been shocking you. They've already tried to shut me down once. You'll never shut me down, Mr. Zuckerberg. All right, I'm going to show you pictures of good American children and what they have turned into after one shooting up of marijuanas. They shot it up. Now, mind you, shooting up marijuanas is the most potent way for your body to accept marijuanas and then decline it. Marijuanas are dangerous. And this is what I want to show you to sum it up. Marijuanas will turn you from a good American little baby boy or girl into a heathen or worse yet, a Greek. Now, I've, you've been warned. Now, this is my little buddy. He's a kid from the neighborhood. This is when he was getting some hay. His daddy's on a tractor, and he's up here, and he's got the American flag, and he says, Daddy, that's who I love the most, America. And here's what happened to him a week later after using one shooting up of marijuana's. Here he is in the club. You can see by his eyes and the way he is real loose with his body. He is doped up right now, as a matter of fact. You can see he has no care, no care in the world. No one's really surrounding him, has zero friends. But, man, he, he looks, and I want to show you, he appears to be having a good time. I want you to notice that people are touching him. He doesn't care. People can invade your personal space. Look at the way he's bobbing his head and moving around. Is this what you want from marijuana's? Is this what you want for marijuana? You want to be moving around, sack jacket ass around? You want to be sack jacket ass with this kid out on the street? Look at him. He can't. He, oh, they tried to shut me down. They shut me down again. Huh, 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 huh. 
<laughs> I'm laughing again. <laughs> Judy! Hey, everybody. <clears throat> All right, so you saw this little sack, sack jack. You saw this little sack-ass jack. You saw him dancing. Is this what you want to end up like? Isn't this weird that they keep shutting me down? Isn't it weird? Let me just do this. Isn't it weird that I keep tr getting shut down tonight of all nights when I'm delivering the truth in the hottest of fashions that everyone is trying to shut me down when I'm delivering the truth? The media is owned by the Latinos. Everyone knows it. They're trying to shut me down and they can't shut us down. Okay. They'll never shut us down because this is these are the eyes of truth. These are the eyes of substance abuse. All right, everybody, let's get back on track here. I was showing you some heinous before and afters. Let me get to one more. Let me get to one more, because I don't know how much time I got on here. All right, here's a nice little baby. Here's little Pee-Pee. The, the, the parents named her little Pee-Pee. Her, her first name begins with P. And the middle name begins with P. Little Piper Parabo. They call her PP. She was a good little baby. And I want you to take a good look at this. I want you to take a good look at this baby's face. Everyone take a good freaking look at this baby's face, okay? Because that's a cute baby. And I want you to see something, all right? I want you to see something. This is this baby now. This is this baby now. Look at this baby moving its hips. Baby, you gonna move your hips like this? How's a baby gonna move his hips? This is what it used to look like. This is what this baby used to look like. And this is what this baby looks like now. All right, guys. I'm sorry for all the technical and inconveniences. I I have a whole setup here, and I'm underground. And I don't want to tell you guys where I'm at, because if I would, it would compromise everyone who is listening to this entire webcast here. I'm not some sack jack who's just holding his phone in his car like some, some sassy sack jack. I'm not that guy, okay? I'm not some guy who went to broadcast school. I went to broadcast school, and I know what I'm doing. That's ridiculous, okay? Here's another deal, Okay. I got a whole setup here, and I'm doing it all on myself for you, okay? Are you guilty? You should be, because I'm doing this for you. All right, I'm going to show you one more terrifying thing, okay? And I want you guys to get your phones ready, because you're probably going to want to screenshot the, the horror you see so you can share it with your friends, because it's going to be awful, I promise you. This is going to be one of the most awful things you've done ever seen in your life. I don't know how much time I have left for you, for you freaks in the sophisticated Hoosiers page. But this is a young girl, probably abducted, okay? And she's surrounded by what I assume are Sudanese warriors, okay? So I'm going to show you the picture. And, and CNN's not going to show you this stuff. Fox News isn't going to show you this stuff, Okay. All right, they're not going to show you this stuff, and I'm going to show you this one picture, and it's going to be horrifying. You're going to see the face of fear. See this young lady? That's the face of fear. See that? That's fear right there. See that? That's fear, okay? See that? And look, imagine if you were her. Imagine you were this young girl. Like, oh, no, I'm surrounded. I'm scared. What am I going to do? This is getting scary. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't make me do it, everybody. I never wanted to get into this stuff, but now look at me. Like our white women would want anything to do with any of this. Look how ca she's terrified. She's damn it. She's terrified. Now, guys, I appreciate you being with me. I appreciate you guys being with me through all the technical difficulties because I swear to the good Lord Almighty, the American dream is out there for you. If you renounce cannabis, 
Okay, cannabis is a sin. Everyone knows that. It's a man-made, you know, the cannabis, if you want good cannabis, you go to the University of Mississippi. Okay, that's where you can get good cannabis. The stuff they're growing now is like scientists putting in nanobots. And then they got sterile stem cells and making no males. We got to rid ourselves of all the males. That's real weird of the cannabis industry. Because males, how would we have ever done anything ever? We'll get rid of the males in the cannabis industry. Ridiculous. I'm tired of it. I've had enough. I hope you have too. Be sure to join us next time. Till then, learn up, live up, and God bless you.